Now we're going to install a cold water ground clamp. As you can see here, this is where we're going to have to put it. You want to make sure that you clean anything off of the pipe so the conductivity is good and you have a great connection between the clamp and the pipe itself. In this case, we have a lot of paint that's on this pipe. I'm going to get this paint off of here as best we can. You can use sandpaper. I happen to use just the razor blade. When you install your ground clamp, you want to ensure that the hooked side is down and going with gravity. So if it was to hang there, it could hang there on its own with no problem. Now we're just going to tighten up the screws so that the set screws are nice and tight. Make sure that they're firm up against that pipe. Take turns alternating back and forth as you go so you have a good even connection. You want to open up this a little bit. You're going to go inside your panel. In this particular panel, there's a knockout in the back there that's set up specifically for us to put a ground through. So we're going to push the ground up through here and then bring it up to our ground connector. Once again, we like to Leave a little extra on the end of the clamp after we tighten it down. And then we like to bend that little bit of extra down and around. finished cold water pipe clamp. Crank down on the main bonding screw there as well again to make sure it's good and tight. We've seated our copper right onto the copper bus. We like to try and make sure that everything's pretty uniform, seated straight, and then we're just going to